Hello everyone. Let us start our new course on learning statistics on Excel. Now, before learning the various functions on Excel, let us get ourselves familiar with the two branches of statistics. The study of statistics can be categorized into two main branches. These are descriptive statistics and inferential statistics. Now before this let us also define some terms which will be very useful in the course of our study ahead. To collect data for any statistical study a population must first be defined. Now what is a population? A population indicates a group that has been designated for gathering data from. Now what is data? The data is information collected from the population. A population is not necessarily referring to people. A population could be a group of people, measurements of rainfall in a particular area or even a batch of batteries. Now, what is a sample? The sample is a set of data taken from the population to represent that population. Now, let us define descriptive statistics. What is descriptive statistics? Descriptive statistics is the term given to the analysis of data that helps describe, show or summarize data in a meaningful way such that patterns might emerge from that data. Measures of central tendency, measures of dispersion, graphical representations using histograms, bar graphs and pie graphs all fall under descriptive statistics. Now let us take an example. If we had the results of 100 pieces of students coursework, we may be interested in the overall performance of those students or we might also be interested in the distribution or spread of the marks. Descriptive statistics will allow us to do this. Now let us see what is inferential statistics. Inferential statistics makes inferences about populations using data drawn from the population. Instead of using the entire population to gather the data, the statistician will collect a sample or samples from the millions of residents and make inferences about the entire population using that single sample. Probability distributions, hypothesis testing, correlation testing, and regression analysis all fall under this category of inferential statistics. In the next video, we will cover the measures of central tendency, which is an important part of descriptive statistics. Thank you.